If there's one thing that we've learned from NFL protests it's that the social justice warriors involved are willing to pay tribute to anyone or anything other than America. No matter how much these entitled players benefit from the United States' free economy and the service members who have given their lives so that we remain free, they persist in insulting America and praising everyone else. Watching the players of this season's protest is reminiscent of watching a teenager who rebels against the parents who gave him life and food and housing, just because they told him he couldn't do one thing he wanted to do. In both cases, they stomp off to their Range Rovers and sulk like children, cursing the hand that feeds them. That persona slips away, however, when there's an actual danger at hand. If you don't believe me, just take a look at what happened during Sunday's NFL game with Mexico. One of the anthem protest's biggest supporters, Marshawn Lynch, not only sat out our national anthem, but he stood in respect for the Mexican anthem. Fox News reported that the president both took notice, and had a few ideas for how to deal with Lynch's blatant disrespect, underscore President Trump on Monday slammed a top NFL player who sat for the Star Spangled Banner but stood for Mexico's national anthem, and offered a new directive, suspend him for the remainder of the season. Underscore, underscore Oakland Raiders running back Marshawn Lynch sat during the majority of the U.S. national anthem but stood for the Mexican anthem before his team's game Sunday against the New England Patriots at Azteca Stadium in Mexico City. Underscore, underscore Marshawn Lynch of the NFL's Oakland Raiders stands for the Mexican anthem and sits down to booze for our national anthem. Great disrespect. Trump tweeted. Next time NFL should suspend him for the remainder of the season. Attendance and ratings way down. Underscore, obviously, the president can't require that Lynch be cut, but the NFL is in dire straits as far as their business is concerned so they might want to listen to the advice. Americans have gotten sick of watching millionaires pretend that they know what's best for the country, and have left the NFL in droves, but still, the players persist. Underscore the president has seemingly taken it easy on the NFL for the past few weeks, likely because he was overseas for a 13-day Asia tour. But Sunday, he again addressed the NFL's national anthem controversy. Underscore, underscore according to Sports Illustrated, Lynch has protested the anthem all season and has not stood for the anthem since coming out of retirement to join the Raiders. Underscore, underscore NFL players who have protested the national anthem this season by taking a knee, or sitting on the bench, reportedly do so to protest police brutality and injustice, rather than the U.S. Underscore, underscore the now months long feud began dominating headlines in September after a rally in Alabama when Trump called for players to be fired if they disrespected the flag spurring the controversy. Underscore, underscore wouldn't you love to see one of these NFL owners, when somebody disrespects our flag, to say get that son of a underscore B, off underscore the field right now. Out. He's fired. He's fired. Trump said to the crowd at the rally, drawing criticism from NFL players as well as NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell. Underscore, underscore the president has repeatedly tweeted about his disappointment in the NFL players, and managers for their lack of rules and regulations to ensure players stand for the anthem. Underscore, this move was especially insulting because of the U.S. border wall project that Mexico has been trying to block at all costs. Mexico is perfectly happy with the arrangement we currently have where any undesirables that they want to get rid of can be shipped north. Assuming it gets too tough for some drug lord in Mexico, he can just jump a fence or swim a river and carry on his business in peace. The U.S. and Mexico flags are displayed at Azteca Stadium before Sunday's game. Oakland Raiders running back Marshawn Lynch sat for the U.S. anthem but stood for the Mexican one. Another reason Lynch's move is noteworthy is that when considering the possible reasons behind his respect for the Mexican national anthem, it's hard to ignore the possibility that it's because he didn't want to risk getting into trouble. America has made it clear that while most of us don't appreciate these protests, they're perfectly legal. There won't be anyone throwing cuffs on a person who sits for the anthem or stomps on a flag. Mexico, however, has a reputation for being less forgiving, and their prisons less cushy.
it's hard to ignore the idea that Lynch probably stood for the Mexican national anthem because he actually feared the repercussions if he didn't. This is kind of what the president was getting at with his tweet a while back, when he said that disrespecting America have some consequences. Of course, they don't have to give any punishment to players like Lynch, and we don't have to start watching their games again. H slash T, Fox News. Thank you.